Then in chapter number four of Professor Carabine's John Scotus Erigena, in chapter number four we have the title of Creator and Creation. So far we have seen divine nature as simultaneously viewed as immanence and transcendence of God. That is the four divisions of nature that Erigena does in number one and number four, the parts that are uncreated, that relate to God as first cause and final end, necessarily relate to God in terms of created reality that is coming forth from God or returning to God. This means that in the periphysium of Erigena, which is the work that we're talking about, all speculation will be from and about the process of creation. So the departure point of speculation is creation itself.